Both teams are lining up for the kickoff, and we're just about set to get this one underway. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Baylor's a team and a program that year in, year out, has got 1,000-yard rushers. Sometimes they've got two, and they've got that huge offensive line, and, you know, you get too worried about them, and sometimes you can overlook the fact that he's going there. It's going to be tough today for this defense. I think they're going to have to take some chances and load this line of scrimmage. And, you know, as a play caller for this offense, when you have such a gifted running back, it opens up every aspect of the offense. I mean, the play-action pass with this running game, you get those linebackers and safety's coming up close to the line of scrimmage. It's a great time to really open up and show what you can do as a complete offense. It'll be a challenge. Got his receiver, dropped it, incomplete. From their own 27-yard line, third down. Two down, three down. Hey, alert 48. Hey, we don't like the three. Ten, two. Red set. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. I'm sure the defense thought he came up short. You know, sometimes the officials' judgments can have a big impact on a game. Three down, three down. Hey, alert 48. Hey, we're going to mic the 48. Kill, kill, kill. Gun three, 15. Check 25. Check 25. Check 25. They go back to him on a quick throw. Tackle the 37-yard line. That play was going nowhere. Yeah, give a lot of credit to the defense here, recognizing pass and swarming to the receiver. tries to buy some time. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Diving for extra yardage. Well, this is a nice run for the first down by this quarterback. They'll bring him down at about the 45. He knew it was a run all the way. Got a good jump. Once he got there, he wasn't about to let him slip away either. It's second and 12. Ball on the 45. Got a receiver and he dropped it. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Completely stopped immediately. The defense didn't stop the pass, but they stopped him short of the sticks. And that's the important thing here. Allow him to make the catch, but make sure you tackle him before he gets to the first down marker. They're trying to pin them deep with a solid punt right here. He punt. No, he faked it. And he's tackled at the 31. You can bet that the quarterback is smiling over there on the sidelines. Let's see if they do something with the ball now that they have another shot at it. Tenth play of the drive. There's a strike complete. And down he goes at the 13. I think he was going to go to his tight end the whole way, but the defense didn't expect it. Sometimes those big guys can fool defenders into thinking they're blocking. Tackle at the five. Watch 14. Watch 14. That'll bring up second and three. Touchdown, Baylor. And he tacks on the extra point. So a 12-play, 74-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. So our score, 7-0. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. Under pressure. Tackle made around the 34-yard line. And he's 
tackled around the 45 yard line. Up the middle for a nice game. Brought down to 39 yard line. Inside the 10, and he's taken down around the four yard line. First down, and they are very close to tying this thing up. Shows some moves, and he's in. It shouldn't have surprised these guys to see the run coming at them, but they just couldn't stop it. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. And he converts the extra point. So a seven-play, 76-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. Brad, not only did they put points up on the board, but I think it's the way they did it. That could be demoralizing for defense. We're even at seven in this one. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. This offense threw the ball extremely well on their last drive, and they ended up with a touchdown. Well, it's one thing to have speed. It's another thing to have an idea of what you're doing and how to attack a defense. And right now, these wide receivers clearly have done an outstanding job in being able to make their reads and getting out of their breaks and the quarterback put the ball right on the money. That makes it second and 10. From their own 25-yard line, second down. And they make the stop around the 37-yard line. First down. Larry, Larry. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Mike is 59. Kill, Black kill, five. kill. Black Orange three. Orange three. Orange. He's taken down at the 44. Gain of 19 yards. That makes it first and 10. Mike is 59. Mike is 59. Kill, kill, kill. Gunner three. Blue 20. Gets it. He's in space. Knocked out of bounds. Around the 36-yard line. Gain of eight yards. That brings up second and one. Mike is 59. Mike is 59. Kill, kill, kill. Blue four. Blue four. Take over. So the quarterback keeps it on the option, but he'll lose a yard. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Makes it out to about the 29. That's how we do, D. That's how we do. They don't want to know. They don't want to know this. First down. Hey, two. Hey, two. He's at the 20. Gains his way to the 13-yard line. That's a game of 16. First down. Check 59. Mike. Mike is 59. Mike is 59. Check. Check. Orange three. Orange three. Nice.
this run up the middle. That brings him second in five. second touchdown of the day. This guy has great vision out of the backfield. Even if a hole isn't there, he's patient enough to wait for one to open, and then he hits it. And he adds the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. It's early in this game, so the defense can still have an opportunity to make some adjustments. But if things don't turn around in a hurry, it's really going to start to affect the psyche of that defensive line. Gets to around the 42. So after one quarter of play, can it continue to be this high scoring? The Bears lead it 14-7. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set to start the second quarter. Throw incomplete one of his receivers. From their own 42 yard line, it's second down. Fires out to his wideout. He's knocked out of bounds right around the 46 yard line. it out to his receiver in a hurry. Tackle around the 40-yard line. Gets it out quickly. And he's level at the 34-yard line. That'll make it second and four. He can run, makes his way out to about the 15. Completes it, but he can't shake the defense. That makes it second and six. I got two, I got two. And he hits him hard at the five-yard line. It's the ninth play of the drive. So he punches it into the end zone for the second time today. You know, this quarterback continues to score touchdowns, and you can see how happy this makes his offensive lineman. A running quarterback and a quarterback scoring touchdowns with his legs takes a lot of pressure off the big boys up front. He makes the PAT. Looks like they're ready for the kick. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And they can forget about returning this one. Just amazing, Herbie. We've seen four straight possessions now in which the offenses have scored. They've been like a couple of fighters feeling each other out so far. Let's see if they start to open it up a little bit more now. Under heavy pressure. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. Coming to you, coming to you. Second and 10. Mike, Mike, Mike. 
Ball on their own 25. Quick throw out to the receiver. They'll bring him down at the 36. Scrambling around, and they got him. He has one job on passing situations, get to the quarterback, and he did that job very, very well on that play. So it's second down and 13 yards to go following that quarterback sack. Throws it in a hurry. They completed it, but for a minimal gain. It's not much, but at least it's positive yards. That'll make it third and 13. Go, kill, 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 kill. Green kill, nine. Clear. Green nine. And down he goes around the 48-yard line. He's going to be sacked. Boy, this pass rush is sometimes scary. They're really getting after the quarterback now. That'll make it second and nine. So the sack makes this a second and long. And off up the middle. He gets out to about the 42 yard line. That's a good one. Over the middle to his tailback. Man, the defense jumped all over that one. No chance to pick up the first down there. And this one is a beauty. Touchback. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. This is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime. And he is drilled at the 21-yard line. And he gets a yard on the run. From their own 21-yard line. Second down. Fires that quickly, incomplete. That's going to bring up fourth down. On third down, the defense was expecting the pass, and they defended the play very well in the secondary. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. He's taken down at the 40-yard line. You always want to go in the locker room with momentum, so as we get closer to halftime, I think we'll see more and more attempts to create big plays. Setting up blockers or running backs, got it on the screen. A pickup of four on the play. They executed the screen play well here by getting the ball to the halfback. They pick up some yards. Check, check, check. Second down and six. Ball on the 44. He's tackled at the 43 yard line. That's a gain of 13 on the play. That makes it first and 10. He's scrambling. Tackle made right around the 40. And a quick throw. Steps out of bounds. Right around the 34. 
Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. He's into the open field. And he tackles him hard at the 24-yard line. That's a game of 10. Check 59. Mike. Easy two. Yellow three. 20. And it's caught, and he's brought down quickly. Baylor's going to have to use their second time out of the half. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Red two. Kill, kill. You ain't going to do Quick throw, he gets hit out of bounds around the 15-yard line. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Third down. Throws a laser across the middle. That's a great tackle at the two-yard line. Kill, kill, kill. That makes it first and goal. Red, two, yellow, three. Kill, kill. Panther, two. Here they come, and he throws it away. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. Red two, blue four, go! Touchdown, Baylor! Splits the uprights with the extra point. Baylor ready to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. And he just gets rid of it. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 25. They come out in a five-wide set. He's hit and taken down. He made a really good move at the line of scrimmage. Sometimes all you need to do is throw off the defender's timing just a little bit at the start of the play. Complete. He's got room. And he's tackled around the 46-yard line. Chucks it downfield. Doesn't get there. Perfect timing to jar the ball loose and not pick up the penalty. That was a solid play. From the 46-yard line, it's second down. Wants to go long and does. Knocked down, incomplete. under some heat and he throws right away and he hauls it in brought down at the 10 a good look and pass that time well, here they do a nice job of getting the ball out to their speedy receiver and he shows you that he not only can turn on the jets but he's got pretty decent hands as well the kick is up and it sails through the uprights i'd say the offensive coordinators definitely showed their wares in that first half 21 17 bears Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Bruce Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. 
This game's been everything we anticipated it being, each team matching each other blow for blow, just a one possession game at this point. What do you expect to change things in the second half? Well, it, it's always it's always fun to watch two teams and two games ma match up the hype. And we, we talk about it all week and how big this game is, and it's going to come down to players making plays. And, you know, the, the big play is something that we continue to beat into the ground. And which one doesn't give that up? A lot of times, you know, games are lost and won by turnovers and, and giving it away and making that crucial mistake. You can do everything right and you can execute right, but it just takes that one misstep, that one turnover to, to really put you in a bad position or a bad situation that can determine this game. That's what it looks like it's going to. Both teams executing well. Who's going to make a big mistake? Just about set to start the second half. What are you looking for? I I'm looking to see which team has that decided schematical advantage. And if they can find it, they'll blow holes three or four axe handles wide. Brad and Kirk will be there to call the second half. Very close game now as we start the second half. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Wow, close game here. And up and down the field with both these offenses matching what the other's done. Well, it's fun to watch each offense get an opportunity to go out and make plays. And you're right, you almost feel as, as if one offense feels challenged and has to be able to bounce back, and they've done that. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Quick strike to the receiver. And he's taken down around the 39-yard line. Short over the middle. He's taken down at the 46-yard line. There's a strike complete, and they make the stop around the 33-yard line. And he throws it away. It's second and 10. Ball on the 33. They bring him down for a sack on the play. The defenders played the snap count perfectly. He found the path into the backfield and didn't let the quarterback get away. He goes out of bounds at about the 29-yard line. It's fourth down. So the kicker comes out. He'll try to put three points on the board. The kick is away. It's long enough. And it's good. Notre Dame gets set to kick this one away. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Baylor with a one-point lead. Steps up and he's sacked for a loss. They find themselves in a hole here after that sack. It's second and long. Gains his way to the 30-yard line. That's a deal of 12 on And he's immediately tackled. 
first down. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Mike to 59. Watch the screen. Watch the screen. He scrambled. He's wrapped up for the sack. Boy, this defense really came to play today. Well, they said before the game that they wanted to put a lot of pressure on this quarterback. They sure stuck to that plan. From their own 34-yard line, second down. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. It's caught. Tackle at the 47 yard line. Gain of 13 on the play. First down. The sub package in there defensively in this five wide receiver set. Got a man. Watch out here. They'll bring him down at the 37. That's a gain of 16 on the play. That makes it first and 10. Baylor is up one. Quick pass, and he hits him hard at the 28-yard line. Gain of nine yards. That brings him second and one. Let's get it together. Kill, kill, kill. X flare. 17. Check Makes it out to about the 13. Finds a man, touchdown. And did that play ever develop nicely? Well, it's all about the receiver on this play. He beat his man off the line and then ran a perfect route. All he had to do after that was make the catch. It was a textbook post route, and the pass was right on target. And he adds the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. He's into the open field. He makes his way out to about the 35. Off, and he's taken down for a loss. That's a loss of two yards on the play. That'll bring up second and 12. From their own 33-yard line, it's second down. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Excellent open field tackle. Defense goes with the extra defensive backs as the offense comes up five wide. On the throw, incomplete pass. This is a well-designed play by the offensive coordinator. Everything really seemed to be working just fine, except for the quarterback. He's got to throw a better football. They try to run up the middle, but met in the backfield. That'll, That'll make, make it third, third and 13. 13. Third down now, and they need to get it inside the 41. Tight right, tight right. They come out on an empty backfield. <laughs> Got it. Complete. He's out of bounds. They'll drop him for a loss. Yeah, 
loss of three yards on the play. That makes it third and three. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Strike to his receiver, no good. Number two was the intended receiver on the play. Fourth down. He gets it up, and it's long enough, and he just drilled it from long range. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Nice kick, plenty of distance. He's to the 20, heading for the corner. He gets hit out of bounds at the 31-yard line. Last time out, they were able to pick up big chunks of yards through the air. You wonder if they'll go back to that same strategy or will they start to lean a little bit more on their ground game. He fights forward to about the 33. That's a game of two. That makes it second and eight. Slings it, and he's stopped behind the line. And he is drilled at the 25-yard line. Sack makes this a fourth and very long. He really got a hold of that one. Not great, but not bad either. As long as your main priorities are not turning the ball over and establishing solid field position, then you're headed in the right direction. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. Once he saw it was a run, he made a great break on the ball and used his speed to make the big tackle. We'll head to the final quarter of play. Will the offensive fireworks continue? The Bears lead it 28-23. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. Watch the curl, watch the curl. Take four, take four. Go, go. Screen pass, he's got his half back. Tackle made around the 43-yard line. The quarterback and his receiver make a great play here and convert on an early down. Third down. He's got it out to his tight end. When you only need a couple of yards on third down, as a quarterback, you always want to try to find a receiver to throw to that's across the first down marker. It's fourth down, and the offense is getting set to go for it. Short yardage situation, and the offense is in the jumbo package. Here's the tight end. Drops. I'm not sure the offense had much of a choice here. It was a pretty short conversion. The defense just made a good play. Really a great stop by the defense. This will go down as one of those critical plays. A score here might effectively end this one. Hey, alert 48. Hey, we're going to 48 right now. Let's go. Quick out to his receiver. That's good for a gain of 10 yards. That'll make it second and inches. Hey, we're going to 48 right now. Let's go. Easy. Here's an opening. And he carries the ball for a nice game. That's how we do, D. That's how we do. They don't want none. They don't want none of this. First down. Easy. Easy. Three, nine. Blair. Three, nine. Blair. 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 
Nice run up the middle. The misdirection play gets him four yards. That makes it second and six. Black five, black five, green twenty. Throws into coverage, just picked off. And they'll return this one all the way. Inside the 10. And it's a whole new ball game. Man, that was a super play by the defender. Excellent interception and an even better return for the score. You don't really gain anything by kicking the extra point here, so they'll go for two and try to go up by three. Notre Dame, up a point. And they get the two. They line up to kick this one away. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So the offense will come back out onto the field, hoping for a little better result than that last pick six. Brad, it's very important that this offense put that last possession behind them and just focus on trying to put together some positive plays right now and see if they can put a drive together. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. And they've got the dime package in there to try and deal with this five-receiver look. And he throws it away. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. At about the 35. Got his man. Can't tack on any yardage. He's got it with room to run. Brought down at the 48-yard line. That's a deep nine on the play. First down. Just under three to go in regulation. Scrambling around. They bring him down. Second and 15. Ball on the 44 yard line. Black five, black five. And he just gets rid of it. Here's the eighth play of the series. The offense going to try to open this field up, coming out in a five wide set. And the defense counters with their dime look. He's tackled. That's the 46. And this one is a beauty. Little too much leg into that punt. They'll bring it out to the 20. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Down! Blue 14! Blue 14! Motion, motion, motion. Hey! Brought down after a nice run up the middle. And a six-yard pickup by the halfback on the delay. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Let's go one more. Get in! New seven. Motion, motion, motion. Now 
he tries to buy some time. And he's taken down around the 31-yard line. He kept the ball on that one and picked up the first down. I think it's a great decision by the quarterback here to take off and run. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. He's to the 40, and he tackles him hard at the 45-yard line. Well, the execution of this offense has been on display here in this drive. They know what they needed to do, and that's pick up the first down, work the clock, and finish this game off. And with that first down, they may have done it. And they make the stop at the 48. From their own 48-yard line. Second down. He's into the open field. He's knocked out of bounds at the 42. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. He takes a knee. It's second down, 12 to go. Ball on the 44-yard line. Set down. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. He's taken down around the 17-yard line. the end of the ball game and our final score in this one 31 28 Notre Dame well, that's it for this presentation of NCAA football 14 for Kirk Kirk Street I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks and we'll see you soon <laughs>